Hello my friends and welcome back to Homestead Hobbies and Collectibles. Today we have another IGS unboxing. So, let's see what we got. So, we have seven submissions back from IGS. Now, we're going to start with the big one. We'll just make this the norm. Doing the big one first. Now this first one's Goonies. It's a black clamshell. Unsure on. I think I went for the better seal over the better. Um, over the better uh, box condition. I'm sorry, guys. I'm not ready to record. This is really early in the morning. I don't have all my coffee. They were here real early to uh, get my package to me, I'm not, and I can't wait to unbox it, so I'm gonna push through this. All right, so we have Goonies. The back looks pretty good. There's a side, the bottom. Does this not have watermarks on it? It's the other side. It's still cold. That's uh, yeah, I think I went with the one with the better seal, but I don't think this thing's gonna grade too bad either. We might have a little seal poke here. So, let's see what we got here. Here's the front. Some goonies. Now the earliest one's a slip cover with the wraparound watermarks, Warner Brothers. That's the earliest, that's the one that's worth like a ton of money. But this should still be desirable. Let's see what we got for a grade on the box. We got an 8.5. A little disappointed from the quick glance and the seal. We're at an 8.5 also. So we're double mint. So I really thought this would be better. I guess we do have a hit right here. It is much harder to uh, judge clamshells. Well, with that hole right there, it's expected to be an 8.5 on the seal. <clears throat> That's good. I'm happy with it. So some of the other movies I sent in in this lot is going to be an E.T. Pepsi promo. We have the original uh, 1989 uh, uh, Indiana Jones trilogy in here with the bottom barcode. It's more desirable. We have that in here. We have, what else did I send? Oh, I got a Courtney Cox Scream in here somewhere. And there's another one. I can't remember the other one. Heck, there might be another two. I, I sent in seven. Obviously, this is the ET. Didn't give that one away, huh? Got the Pepsi promo ET here. So let's see what we got. I, I'm suspecting that this is not going to be the best grade. This may be my worst one yet. Okay, so I'm going to put some gloves on so I don't fog up the glass here so this seal was extremely loose you can see it right here they did a really good job placing it we will see though all right so we will cover this and look at the front this does have the side MCA watermarks and uh, let's see what we got. I'm, I'm eager to see this one. This is the first time me seeing this, guys. These are still cold from being in the truck. And... What? What? Oh my. Oh my goodness. 
Oh my goodness. Well, guys, we scored a 9.5 gem on an ET Pepsi promo with a mint seal. Did I say this was going to be my worst one? What? What? Oh my goodness, guys. Oh my goodness. Well, that's going to be a tough one to beat. So <laughs> let's keep moving on, shall we? Wow. That is amazing. All right. I wonder if that's top pop on that. I wonder if that's top pop. Because, wow. All right, so we have a Raiders of the Lost Ark. This is, uh, I'm really trying for tens on these. I don't, I want to say, uh, Raiders is going to be the one that was the worst, but I was trying for my best. I have several sets of these because I really, really want to see an entire trilogy 1010 or an entire one gem gem. You know what I mean? So I've been buying them and trying to get them. Now, here is the bottom barcode, more desirable, 1989 release of Raiders of the Lost Ark. It has the side paramount watermarks. Here's the bottom. Yep, this is, this is going to be the worst. Now we're going to come move over to the other side here. Looking good, looking good. Let's see what we got. What did we score? Here's the front. These are the Diet Coke ones. So they have the Diet Coke rebate. And for the box, we got a, an 8.5. And a 9.5 seal. Why is... Oh, wow. I may not have noticed that. There's actually a hit right here. I may have dismissed as being the seal. It's actually the whole corner. That's the problem with these trilogies. Is you will end up with uh, damage inside of them. Like the seal will be beautiful, but there will be damage on the inside. So, let's keep moving on. Maybe they kept me in order with the trilogy here. We'll see. Not in order, there's Last Crusade. How'd they label this? Oh, it says Paramount Diet Coke sticker. Okay. will all be bottom barcode so the first release of the trilogies had the diet coke stickers on them and here we go the back hey you know what i may have just sent them in to match you know that we'll see if this turns out to be an 8.5 we may have just sent them in to match there's the side watermarks here's the other side and let's see. We got a different Coke sticker on this one, but that, that's how they all are. So there's the front. Awesome artwork. Awesome, awesome. 95 gem, 9 mint. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Beauty. That's a beauty. Right there. So I did want to originally sell those as a trilogy. But being an eight five to a nine five, I, I'm I may let's see what the, let's see what the next one looks like, the next uh, Indiana Jones one. All 
All right, yep, there's the Temple of Doom. Okay, so we have the bottom watermark. I think this is a, this one actually had a rollover, I believe. You know, had a rolled over bottom part. I don't know how they're gonna hit that, so we will see. You know, I think these were in better condition when I sent them in. I think maybe I gotta take a look at my packaging. One side, here's the watermarks. And what do we got? Oh, first we'll look at the cover. I really gotta get that down, don't I? All right. Temple of Doom. We got a $5 Coke sticker, like the Raiders of the Lost Ark. So what did we get? We got a 9.5 gem with a nine seal. Okay. So we got matching ones right here. Oh. We got a couple matchers, guys. We got a couple matchers. Do I sell this as a trilogy? Or do I sell them individually? Hmm. That's a tough one right there. Nine five gem. All right, on to the next one. So this is either going to be the one I don't remember what it is, or it's going to be the Courtney Cox screen. Leave a comment. Which one do you think is in here? Scream, or just put a question mark. You can tell which one sides the back of these because the back has like a little lip and the front smooth. So this is the scream. If you guess scream, you are correct. Now this one did. This is the Courtney Cox scream. Here's the back. I think this one had a seal issue as well as condition issues. And here's the bottom. Doesn't look too bad. Doesn't look too bad. Here's the one side. It's not too bad. There is not watermarks on these. Just the sticker seal. And what did we get? Oh, let's look at the front. Let's look at Courtney Cox. How you doing, Courtney? Pretty cool. So they did come out with different variants. They have the, um, the Courtney Cox, the Nev Campbell, and they have the, uh, what's her name? The blonde. The blonde. Oh my goodness, I can't remember her name. Anyways, the grade is nine box, nine seal. Drew Barrymore, it says it right there, Drew Barrymore. Very cool, very cool. All right, now what is this mystery one? What is it? Can't remember. I'm trying to remember. I do have a list, by the way. I just, I've been trying to remember it. Oh, it was a normal old Jurassic Park. Nothing special, guys. Nothing special. Just a movie I wanted to see if I can make some money on. Um, these are one of the 
the lower dollar ones, I cherry picked it. You know, so you look through hundreds of the same movie and you cherry pick one that you think will do all right. And you buy it. And I'm gonna grade it and see what I can get for it. This will probably be a long tail item, so if you're looking for a, a super deal on this, you probably won't get it because uh, it's gonna be too low for me to make money on if I give a deal, so. So I guess depending on the grade, I don't know what the grade is. If it's a high grade, it's still worth money. And with the MCA watermarks, spread apart ones. A good looking bottom. So the seal looks alright. I don't see anything wrong with the seal so far. I think it had stickers on it. it. Did have stickers on it. I don't think I noticed that. That it had the stickers. So this is a, a first commercial. This is does have the barcode, but let's see what she brought up. A nine mint. Nine mint, double mint. Okay, so yeah, this is a $15 movie. I may have paid less for it. Um, but I was just looking for condition and the best price I could find. And I wanted to see um, if I could make money on it. If I could make money on a $15 uh, VHS with a little bit of submission and shipping fees, you know? We'll see. Well, my friends, that is it for today. I would have to say that this is the winner right here. This, this is the one. That is uh, that's quite amazing. Quite, quite, quite amazing. I mean, wow, beautiful. I wish that seal grade was higher. Oh, man. Well, my friends, hit that thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button. And uh, leave a comment. Let me know what you think about today's haul. Peace!